representing Salt Lake Figure Skating in Salt Lake City, Utah, ladies and gentlemen, Nathan Chad. When you think about the names and the history from Dick Button to Scott Hamilton to Brian Boitano, this man right here may be poised to become the next great name in American men's skating. Nathan Chen. Mm -hmm. It's ridiculous. He's above 60 points after four elements. And this is a man who won the bronze medal last year at Nationals. Then in the gala, the exhibitions suffered a serious hip injury. And he was away two months. It took him just to be walking without a brace off the ice for five and a half months. He came back and added quads. Difficult jump for Triple Hexel. He always struggles with that, and it's the easiest one in the group. Nathan has not yet performed this free program cleanly with four quads, so now he's really competing with himself. Quads out <laughs> five quads. That's five, the first time ever here at the National Championships, Nathan Chen. And he didn't even need to do it. Look at his technical score, he's nowhere near done. <laughs> well, he is mortal after all. Just a very, very small slip. Just barely anything. I didn't see anything. This is beyond Wow, and in addition to these amazing jumps, he's held the tension of the music, he's kept the audience enthralled. This is America's hope, Nathan Chen. America's hope with the upcoming World Championships, with an Olympics little more than a year away, who's already proven himself against the best in the world, the Javi Fernandez's, the user rule Han Yu's.
One for the record books. No one has ever seen anything like that Nathan at the U.S. Chen. Championships. Bow down to Nathan Chen. I have oh. never seen a skater like him. Ladies, pairs, dance, men, all in all time. There's been so many great ones. Plushenko, Yugudin. This guy. This guy is it, my little quad machine. Oh, and in addition to those quads, in addition to setting all this history, these records that he's all about, he's an artist. He kept everybody into that. He had the eye, he had the facial expression, he just had it all. Huh? It must. It must. Here we go. Thank you. Cool, calm, collected, like mint. For much of that program, his coach, Rafael Aratunian, wasn't even watching. Yeah, he was so just relaxed. pacing, looking at the crowd, looking up at you guys. Yeah, we waved. That's that's <laughs> what Raf said. He said it's not about the quads. A lot of people can do quads. He's a competitor. He can keep his mind on the game, and he's cool and calm, collected, and that's what this is in this quad. That's so difficult, so straight in the air. The reach back into the triple. Cat like. Yeah. And he didn't just get through five quads. He did five quads extremely well. Beautiful reach back here on the quad flip, straight back on the landing. Beautiful landing position. Just the, magnificent. Like, hardly, I don't even know how we can talk uh, about these. The they're type perfect. of stamina that you need to get through that many quads to retain that energy. Uh, I've never seen anything like this. Well, born in those Utah mountains, it gives you some good lung capacity. <laughs> There's something else. Wow, here another quad toe, the fourth. Just, uh. It's just so easy. And even the look on his face. It's just like, yeah. And here, the quad style, the one that we didn't know if he was going to do. Perfect reach back, perfect follow through. Just stunning. He didn't have to do that, but that's why Nathan Chen is so good, because he pushes himself. He's not afraid. And a 17-year-old, I mean... He's skating along the beach, hanging out just like anybody else in Southern California. Jason Brown, a standing ovation at the end of that performance. He's going to become, among the many things here, and it is one for the record books, the youngest to win the U.S. men's title since Scott Allen won it in 1966 at the age of 16. This is what skating means. <laughs> <laughs> it's rare to see Raphael Artunian smile that way. It is. And get a kick out of a performance like that. Okay. That's all. 212.08. The previous record was 187 and change. First place. 318.4. Seven. And Han Yu's our reigning Olympic champion, his highest technical score was 120.92. Nathan, 121.8. I'm telling you guys, I know when I say just to get on the podium at the Olympics, I'm thinking high up on the podium. You can't compare numbers nationally to international, but...